All right, my boy, the dual trial is here. If we can just get three victories in this, we will obtain a pack of the Rage of Chaos, which could literally be anything. I'm gonna be getting in here with some of the new premiere decks, and I'm gonna be showing you guys how to win with Valance. Illuminating different dimensions and all of reality. Let it be known. The epic legend of the Duelist. The needle that marks victory. Many Valance monsters have the effect that trigger if their zone is changed. Arctos 12 Chrotochasm Valance has the effect of changing a monster's zone not only on your turn, but also in your opponent's turn so that you can try to activate various effects depending on the situation. Enjoy the unique playstyle of controlling which zones monsters are in and dominating the field. So we're gonna be getting in there with this deck, my boy. And as I look at this, I'm gonna give a quick review of this deck. When you took a look at my Valance deck, for example, any other Valance decks I've ever built, there's a clear OTK engine in there. I believe with the resources that you can amass with Valance, we can definitely OTK in this deck, but I do not really see a monster that just OTKs. I don't see, I don't see that because we don't have access code here. And then we've got stuff like Zeta, Meltron, and then, but we do have Underworld Goddess. So this is a board breaker. So. At least we got a pretty solid deck. I, I like the build. I think that they overdid it with the um, spirit monster uh, pendulum cards. And I don't know what they were thinking when they put this guy in here. But basically, um, outside of that, the deck is pretty tight. And there's two Valance uh, field spells. Like, like there's four total in here. That's disgusting. And then also, column switch and send it switch that's doing way too much so it's like you know if you if i was looking at this deck like you know and somebody was uh, somebody brought this to me and said dan can you help me fix this deck and this is this is what i got like honestly we would be dropping one of these blue field spells we'd be dropping this and be adding two end perms you know if this is if, if this is all you had and then we we take it from there my boy <laughs> we take it from there we drop this down to one you know, we probably put in some, you know, some Ash, some Maxi action, but you know what's up. We're gonna get in there and do it with this deck and see how it actually flows. All right, this is pretty decent. We can win with this. <laughs> At first, I was worried that I was gonna just draw the best kind of brick, but you know, hey, it worked out. And we're going second, so should be pretty spicy. We've got a lot of options, actually. I don't really know what this deck plays. I didn't even look at it, actually. But I just know that we have a ton of options and this deck does have pretty much everything that you need to pop off, so I'm not worried. And I think whatever he puts on the board beyond the Pendulum and Underworld Goddess, between these two cards, we can out it, whatever it is. It doesn't matter what it is. We're gonna cook this, man. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be good. We're gonna cook him. And if he wants his points, he'll have to take our punishment. Dodo. Wonderful. All right, first, I'm gonna activate the effect of Cone Wise. Then, I'm gonna activate the Waken. Time to wake up, wake up, <laughs> wake up, wake up, wake up. All right, so we're gonna use the wake up to move. We're gonna use it to search. We're gonna go ahead and add the Mad Marquee. And none of these are shiny. I don't like that, that's offensive. Then I'm gonna activate Kung Wizen. We're gonna put this card where it belongs in the spell trap zone. Activate our effect search deck for a, a spell. We are gonna take this one. We are going to place a monster in the spell trap zone. We're gonna use the Valance Wowers and destroy this card. We're gonna add the red one. 
And we're going to destroy this guy. And then we're going to add the Senate switch. Ooh, this man's getting cooked. Pop the Senate switch. Summon Mr. Marquis into the pendulum zone, my beast. Rise, Mr. Marquis. Mr. Marquis activates his effect. Roll the dice. One, two, nice. I'm gonna go ahead and add another Valance Archer. All right, now the time has come to go even more bananas. All right, so now we're gonna just do this. We're gonna link two. Heavy Metal Foes Electromite. Oh yes, let me cook. Time to cook. All right. Heavy Metal Foes Electromite. Search my deck. We're gonna keep it tight. All right, we're gonna take this card, take control. Uh, yes. Yeah. And then we're gonna use Heavy Metal Foes Electromite's effect. All right, we're gonna put this card here. Pendulum Zone. Heavy Metal Foes Electromite. Destroy the Archer. And add the Dominator Duke. And draw a card. <laughs> yes! Yes! All right, here we go. Now I'm gonna use my Voltage Viscount. Rise! Voltage Viscount gives a discount on summoning a monster. So I'll place it in the Spell Trap Zone and use the power of Shinra Bancho to summon him. Come forth, my beast. Now the time has come to go beyond the pendulum. Let's go. Beyond the pendulum's effect activation. Search my deck and add any beast to my hand. What name have we not touched? We have touched all names. Therefore, I will add another card. This spirit shall do nicely. Now, I set my spirit into the spirit pendulum zone. <laughs> Have I ever told you about the power of the pendulum summon? Because you're gonna learn today. All right, here we go. We're gonna summon, do, 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 do. Yes, we're gonna summon one. We're gonna summon uh, two. Uh, we're gonna summon three. All right, here we go. Time to cook. All right, here's one. Here's two. And here's three. And? And say good day. Sayonara. I was gonna take control, but no. Say night night. All right. And then we advance our beast. And let's get our attack points up, boys. First, I will tribute a monster and summon him forth. I will be sending your chaos in, returning to the deck. <laughs> now you pay the price. The Senate is pleased. <laughs> Are you ready? Now nah, we're gonna use that. We're gonna use that. We're gonna keep our boy. We're gonna keep our boy. We just boosted him to 4G. We're gonna keep this man. Prepare yourself. It's our close 12. Now, Valence Shuffle! Attack my beast for 4,000 of those things. Octos 12 attacks! Use your effect! Go, Valence Shuffle! <laughs> this is the power of Valance! Yes, this deck is way overpowered for, for this particular event. My boy, I hope you enjoyed that cook with the power of the Valance. I'll be back tomorrow with even more content. 
Please don't forget to like and subscribe and also leave a comment below letting me know how you'd like to duel with Baylads. Until next time, I'll catch you in the next video. Keep it day. Put my problems in the paper and pass them around. Loud enough to wake the neighbor, they mad at the sound. Trying to dial up the deputy, mad at my brown. My back at the wall, battling straddling blurred lines of where the heat and the fanning begin. Kind of funny what the people call a legend, the government call a weapon, but really he just a man in the end. He just a man in the end. Now I lay me down to sleep, I pray the Lord that I wake again.